In this lesson, we will learn how to plot a pie chart in Matplotlib. First, let us understand what is a pie chart. A pie chart is displayed like this. A round pictorial form divided into slices based on your data. Let's say if you want to show how much percentage of people live in India, you can represent it as a pie chart. Like 25% people live in North India, 20% live in East, 30% live in South and, and the remaining live in West. Okay, so these percentages can be set as a slice in a pie chart. To plot it, you can use the pie method. This is the built-in function provided by Matplotlib. So the same population data or any other data can be displayed like a pie chart to show that how much percentage of people live in a particular area or how much runs are scored in a ground in a particular area percentage. Okay, so to understand this, we will create a pie chart for players scoring runs in a match. But before that, let us see the parameters of the pie method. Some key parameters are shown here. In the first parameter, the width size will be displayed. The second is the labels parameter that will include what you are actually representing in each slice. When we will see the example, the things will be more clear. And the, the third parameter will display a string that labels the wedges with their numeric value. The exact percentage value will be displayed using the auto PCT parameter. It will be in a percentage format. Okay. Let us see the example. Here is our PyCharm ID. We have used the free and open source PyCharm Community Edition. Let us create a new project, file new project. Name the project, let's say it will be Matplotlib PyChart. You can add uh, any name to your project and the project will get saved here. Click create. We have created the project. Now let us add a new Python file. Right click, new Python file. Add the name of the file. We won't add the .py extension. It will get added automatically. Because here Python file is by default selected. Press enter. Now let us add the code. First we will add the comment. Let us begin by importing the Matplotlib library. We have imported the Matplotlib library. And this is the PyPlot submodule. We have also created an alias PLT using AS keyword. Now you don't need to mention the complete library and submodule again and again. Just mention the PLT. Also import NumPy because uh, we will set the we will set the cricket player and his score using the numpy array here it is import numpy as np np is an alias now we will set the data so let's say beginning with the cricketer okay i'll mention numpy dot array and i'll create a new array for the records I'll start with six records beginning with the name of the cricketers. Okay. Six cricketers. Now start with the score. How many runs? Or I can mention runs directly numpy dot array okay now add the runs scored by these cricketers in a match then we will represent it using a pie chart here it is now plot a pie chart using the pie 
okay plt dot pi plt is the same sub module alias plt runs will be represented in the form of a pie chart and the labels labels are really important those percentage of runs were scored by which cricketer that will be represented in the in the labels parameter that means cricketer it will automatically show you that means you are working correctly with your code and this is the format of the output how many percentage so i will show you here it will be visible in percentage and after the decimal two values will be visible that's why it is represented like this display the figure plt dot show we can also set the title okay file save all right click run now let's see what what will be visible here it is i have shown you guys that let me show it like this okay here is our pie chart the title is set here using the title method this is showing that john scored 12% of the runs tim scored 17% of the total runs amit scored 20% of the total runs so this is how we represented it the labels cricketer is showing the names amit john tim gary carl and jacob runs is representing the percentage calculated percentage and this is our format of the output let's say it's 20.54% when i'll set 3 here and i'll run right click run stop and rerun now after the decimal three values will be visible because we have set 3 here okay 1.2f would be fine right click run okay 20.50% of 54% of the runs are scored by amit 19.71% runs are scored by gary we have represented it using a pie chart and this is the title so in this way guys we can use the pie method to represent a pie chart create a pie chart guys we created a pie chart using the pie method this is the built in method provided by matplotlib thank you for watching the video